Distracted driving or driving while under the influence is an avoidable situation. The Arrival Live Tour is a national organization devoted to educating students to put down the phone and remove all distractions before getting behind the wheel. Even with two hands on the wheel, student drivers face distractions. Take a look. <laughs> So I'm actually going to pronounce her dead on that one. Right. Statistics show that about a quarter of car crashes with teens involve an underage drinking driver, and teen drivers are three times more likely than more experienced drivers to be in a fatal crash. The Arrival Live Tour, St. Regis Mohawk Tribal Police, and the Aquasesta Mohawk Police Department have joined forces to talk to the teens at the Salmon River High School about the dangers of drinking and driving. For over 15 years, the Arrival Live Tour has been bringing awareness to teens and adults by using a high-tech simulator, impact video, and a number of other resources to educate the students about the dangers of drinking and driving. Uh, there are sensors on the gas brake and steering, so when we put a student in, they control the gas brake and steering, and then we run them through one of two scenarios, either texting and driving, which is a normal drive where we ask them to text on their cell phone, or drinking and driving where we apply what I'll call a drunk filter that alters their blood alcohol content level virtually. There, there, there is a lot of collisions and, and traffic citations being um, put out today. Um, primarily, there's a lot of overconfidence with this age group, so they, they get into the simulator thinking they're going to do just fine, and, and then we put that blood alcohol content level on and things get a little more real, a little more difficult. 20 miles over the speed limit, swerving, incorrect side of the road, off the road. Well, it's incredibly important to um, bring awareness to the dangers of both drinking and driving and texting and driving, especially in such an impressionable age group as we have in high school. St. Regis Mohawk Tribal Police Department's Community Service Officer P.J. Burns says it's important to educate our youth about the potential dangers in and around our community. Um, the reaction here with the reality of it is showing them what the possibilities and the dangers that are out in our community. So we want to make sure that when they're out, in the community or wherever that they are, if something, if they see something that they're not sure of, chances are we don't want them to t partake in any kind of activities that could lead to some kind of danger. Because let's face it, if something happens, if they get hurt, or if something, a medical emergency happens, we're the ones that's gonna be called and we're gonna be the first ones on the scene. So anytime we can prevent that, it's a good job for the police, uh, from the police service in our community. With tribal police, we brought the, um, the DWI bikes and we have goggles. And what that's going to simulate is the difference between um, being intoxicated with alcohol or marijuana. So the, the students here will get a, um, a chance to see what it, what it is like to be behind uh, a vehicle. And we want to show the importance of if you make that mistake, it only takes one and a half to two seconds to cross that yellow line on either side, so which, which is going to mean that you're either going to be head on with a vehicle or you may be in a ditch or you may even hit a pedestrian. I mean, what was the homework? Maya Swamp, a senior from the Salmon River High School, learned a lot and says she will think twice before answering a text while driving. Uh, I think it's a really good experience and uh, it'll open people's eyes to not like drink and drive or text and drive or do drugs and it's a good experience to come to high school. Uh, I didn't like know how much texting and driving would really like affect your driving so it like opened my eyes to make sure that I'm not doing that. Do you text and drive? Sometimes but after this I'm not going to. It's time to see how I do inside the Arrival Live High Tech Simulator. It's not great. And I'm swerving all over the road. Followed by that collision, you would definitely lose your license. From the Arrival Live event at the Salmon River Central High School, I'm Kevin Lazor, ATV Gollywood Nagale. <laughs>